Hey guys, Sarge here with the March 16th, 1942 combat replay for my 1v1 against Invictus on War of the Pacific Admirals Edition. I'm hoping for some more engagements near Midway. I moved my bombardment force that was just uh, rearming at Laysan Island and was already on its way back. I full sped them and split them up into two groups to try and catch some wounded Japanese ships, so I'm hoping for some hits there. Uh, found a rowboat off of Midway. Oh, we do get a few hits, which is which is nice. Looks like there are some people hitting each other, but we don't actually well, nearly hitting each other. Found a sub off of the Sydney. Oh, we do get a hit on it. It's nice. Oh, I always forget to put absolute. Uh. Absolute stuff so they always engage. So we, we catch, we, well, not catch, we caught some Japanese destroyers. It's at least something we've caught so far. Hello, my misguided friends. What? This Why is are you talking? One enemy, Orphan Anne, from Radio Tokyo. Orphan Anne. Another blow to your morale you lost three destroyers. And music to console you. Today, the Imperial government announced that the Imperial Navy has achieved another great victory near Midway. With the sinking of two carriers, my subs a from Singapore and now. numerous cruisers and destroyers. I tried to like blitz them with like four subs in Singapore to hopefully catch some important ships. Do lose the AK Nightingale from damage previously taken. Bombardment at Palembang. Oh no, pre invasion action. Uh, we don't hit anything, but yeah, nothing happens here really. Uh, 150 casualties, 13 squads, and a vehicle. 25th Army and the Imperial Guards Division. That was heavily, heavily damaged at Singapore. More unloading at Palembang. Uh, sadly, don't get. We're not hitting with our coastal defense guns anymore. Ooh, a friggin' a destroyer. We do get a hit, but there's no explosion. Damn you, permit. Uh, he's trying to get the K17. Nothing happens. Once again, the K17. Does take four hits. Air AM phase. Start off with some very false reports. Here we start the stuff in China. Using valves to bomb stuff that's isolated with no chance of survival. Why is he even bombing this stuff, man? Bombing Port Moresby. My reinforcement convoy was one hex out. So I'm definitely gonna have. Well, so I had the fighters protecting the convoy anyway. But for one turn, I think I'm gonna move in an extra squadron. It is mostly support stuff. Because there really isn't really any support. Uh units there, it's mostly just combat troops.
Okay, pretty uneventful RAM phase, actually. He's got a lot of stuff on LR cap at Palm Bay. These float planes are all on LR cap. Or just cap for his ships. Most likely LR cap though. Actually no, they'd be on those heavy cruisers. It, it, it would just be cap. Do lose the sagebrush as well. Some more bombarding at Palembang. We do hit the AK Ibu Maru once. On to the land phase. Uh, Deadwood attack. Jungle up Alec Poppin. He loses 48 guys. I'd lose nothing. Now we bombard him at Palembang because he landed more troops, which activates bombardment from us. So, three full divisions. Well, mostly full divisions. Imp Guard is, is about 70 or so AV down, at least. He takes 79 casualties, I take 34. Uh, Japanese take Oost Haven with a micro piece of a unit. Yeah, he's using like a bunch of micro pieces of this Yokosuka unit. Alright, Tahiti expands forts to level 2. Uh, do we get any units this turn though? Cruiser, 8th Medium Regiment. I think Medium Regiment is an artillery regiment of like either 4.5 inch or 25 pounders. Well, so with that is the end of the turn, so I will see you guys in the next one.